Okay. After that, we have a thing called the column line. Now this is all these together. But this plus this plus this. What does this add? This adds to now. This adds to factors of production being mobile. This was just a single market for commodities. You know, tomatoes, motor cars, overhead projectors, chalk, and so on. We're now adding the common market. We're now adding mobility of labour, mobility of capital. So I, as a Brit, can work in Italy. I can work in France, etc. Without any restriction. Well, there's a restriction. I don't speak the languages. Big restriction. But maybe anyway, big restriction. But you know, when a Polish Brit comes working in the UK, they can speak the language. Right. Okay, so this now encourages both labour and capital. So we can invest in different countries in the EU under the same rules as our own. So we're, we're getting broad again, see? Free trade, no tariffs, no non tariff barriers. Now we've got freedom of capital production between the, between the, the markets. Then we have the next one, which goes even further MU, which is the monetary union. Let's get 